and to shed more light on uh, the visit of President Abdel Fattah Sisi to France. We're very much honored to have with us over the phone His Excellency Ambassador Hussein Haridi, former Assistant Foreign Minister. A uh, good day to you, Your Excellency. Uh, and to you, Madam. Uh, Ambassador Haridi, would you like to shed light on the importance and the significance of President Abdel Fattah Sisi's visit to France? Well, at the present stage, uh, coordination and exchange of views between uh, Cairo and Paris on uh, various important issues, uh, I guess, are very important and are uh, really needed at this time uh, of uh, fast changes, not only in the regional, on the regional scene, but internationally and in light of uh, a new American administration that is expectedly uh, going to adopt uh, uh, policies uh, regarding the Middle East, the Gulf, North Africa, and the Mediterranean, uh, different from those pursued during the last four years of Mr. Trump's administration. And the uh, talks, uh, talks that President uh, uh, would hold in, in, in Paris would cover uh, major uh, topics, uh, uh, whether in the bilateral relations or in issues uh, in, in the, the, the region, uh, the Middle East, North Africa, the East uh, Mediterranean, and in uh, Sub-Saharan uh, Africa, uh, in addition to uh, the uh, Palestinian question uh, in light of the, Biden, the, the next Biden ad, ad, ad administration. Uh, on the other hand, uh, as far as uh, bilateral issues are concerned, uh, I, I believe that the talks, uh, whether the President Sisi will have, whether with President, French President Emmanuel Macron or with the French uh, Prime Minister, Mr. Gastex, and the presidents, both the speakers of both the National Assembly and the Senate, are, are, are important and to cover almost all uh, questions uh, that pertain, that relate to bilateral, bilateral uh, relations. I, I have, in this, in this context, I would like to uh, stress uh, uh, the uh, strength of relations between Egypt and, 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 and France, and I guess this visit will go uh, in this direction of uh, strengthening this relations uh, for the sake of security and stability in, in, in the region and in North Africa and in the Mediterranean Basin. Yes. Ambassador Haridi, uh, the talks between uh, President Abdel Fattah Sisi and uh, French President Emmanuel Macron are expected to touch, as you um, uh, rightfully mentioned, on several aspects, including uh, the situation in the Mediterranean, the latest developments, of course, the Palestinian issue, issues of mutual concern, but also expected to touch on uh, the economic uh, bilateral relations, especially when it comes to investments here in Egypt, uh, which represent a very important part of the Egyptian economy. How would you comment on that? Well, well, I, I, I completely agree with you, Madam. Uh, uh, the uh, economic cooperation and cooperation with, between the two countries in the field of security and uh, military cooperation uh, would really uh, would be very important topics in, 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 in the summit uh, tomorrow between President Sisi and President uh, Macron. Uh, during the last six years, we have witnessed uh, great strides in military cooperation between the two countries. And uh, as you may know, Madam, uh, the actually, uh, or just recently, uh, there were uh, joint maneuvers uh, between both the Medusa 10, between the Egyptian Greek Cypriot navies, with the participation of French and Emirati elements. So we, we uh, as far as Egypt and France uh, are concerned, I guess there is a, almost a complete identity of views on the nature of the challenges and threats to regional security and stability and, and, and what are the uh, best uh, possible responses to these uh, challenges. And I guess the visit, uh, this official visit that President Sisi would be paying uh, to France starting tomorrow, 
would under would un underline uh, these uh, uh, near identity of views between the two countries. Yes. Uh, the talks are also expected to, to touch on uh, the cultural cooperation. Egypt and France share deep historical cultural ties. And um, uh, the field of culture in particular, if we talk about it, Ambassador Haridi, we would say that uh, the French are fascinated by the Egyptian culture and history, especially uh, the ancient Egyptian history. Uh, since President Abdel Fattah Sisi is expected to uh, also discuss cultural cooperation with France, what do we expect in that regard? I, I believe, uh, Madam, that uh, in the visit program, uh, uh, President Sisi would inaugurate uh, a house for Egyptian students uh, uh, studying in France. Uh, and uh, of course, that means that uh, the Egyptian government is really interested in uh, pushing forward uh, cultural cooperation and academic cooperation between Egypt and France. Uh, as you may, you may recall that historically speaking, uh, France was uh, one of the leading countries in helping Egypt in the field of uh, arts, science, culture and literature and law uh, and that goes back to the mid 19th century uh, so i believe that uh, 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 nothing uh, underlining the importance of cultural cooperation between the two countries and when i say cultural cooperation that covers of course cooperation in the field of academia uh, and higher education and postgraduate studies i guess this is very important and, 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 and very relevant to uh, our uh, plans uh, for modernizing the country and establishing a modern state. Yes. I'd like to thank you very much, Your Excellency Ambassador Hussein Haridi, former assistant for a minister. Thank you very much uh, for being with us here on Cairo Local Time. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, a short break and we'll be right back.